Hello. In this video, we want to explain uh, to you how to start a motor instantly and permanently with a conductor. And uh, two inputs. And uh, two inputs. So one is uh, momentary, and the other is permanent. The starting power circuit is direct. But the common circuit has changed. First, uh, we put a wire and connect, connect it to the base one of the MCB. Well, now we connected the wire from uh, to MCB to the load control C or C. It is shown in the P metal map, but we use load control. Again, we connect a wire from normally open load control uh, to 11 stop SCA, S1. As you can see on the map, we are in a red line. We put a wire again and connect it from 12 stop S1 to 13 start S2. As you can see in the map, it's a red light to 13 stop S2. Now we connect a wire from a 14 starter S2 to A1 conductor K1. As you can see in the map. Now we connect 13 and 14 starter S2 to 13 and 14 start S3. But first, uh, you can uh, connect the A2 to the neutral, terminal neutral. As you can see, this is a black wire. Now we connect uh, 13 and 14 starter S2 to 13 and 14 start S3. Start S2 is a for a permanent work and started S3 is for a moment. Now connect 13 starters S2 to 13 starters S3. Here, as you can see in the map, serial line to 13 is 3. Now we connect from 13 starters S2 or S3 to 11 starters S3.
I'm sorry, uh, it's a mistake. We connect the uh, 14 starters to 2, 14 starters, S3. I'm sorry for this. We connect 14 starters, S2, 2, 14 starters, S3. Now we connect from 13 starters, S2, or S3, to 11 starters, S3. As you can see in the map, there are line. We connect uh, thirteen starters is two, two eleven start is three to eleven starts is two. We can reach from uh, thirteen start is three. Uh, 2, 11, same as 3 starters. Now we connect uh, from 12 starters S3 to 13 conductor K1. As you can see in the map, several lines. So cut it. Why should the wire? Okay, now we connect the uh, K1 conductor uh, to A1 from uh, 14 K1 conductors. We can connect S2 or S3 to 13 starters instead of A1. Well, this is the, the load control. This is the control circuit of this board. Now we have to connect the fuzz, a fuzz and a neutral of the load control. We connect a zero to the load control from base two. We connect the, the null to the load control. From here, the base N on the load control to the A2 to the conductor K1. Tighten it and resolve the wire on the duct. Well, now we test the circuit. With the start S3, we control the motor instantly. Here, as you can see, and uh, with the start. S2, we control the motor continuously, as you can see, repeat it, okay, thank you for watching this video.